All right, so again, uh, we do a lot of work with, with different equipment, different toys, if you will, just again, to emphasize different feelings, different things that we're doing in the water and feeling things in a different way. So I'm gonna have Ryan put on his fins and paddles and he does this drill um, that he really likes, especially when going into a race. Um, it's called the roller coaster drill. And he just, it's just kind of a fun thing to do. I think your younger kids would really enjoy this. Uh, but it's just a good way for him to just feel that whole body movement, that connection through his whole body as he's trying to, to engage his core. And, and, you know, again, when Ryan does his dolphin kick, he kicks with his whole body. Um, and this is just a way for him to really feel that. Right, let's do a couple 25s of that. Again, he calls this the roller coaster drill. We just do this sometimes in warm up just to help feel that connection, help feel that rhythm and motion of the kick. He especially likes to do this when he's at a big meet and he's warming his underwaters up for his 50 free or his 100 freestyle, um, 100 fly, 100 back for that matter. Just a, a good way that, that he likes to warm up for his races. Yeah, so he's really, you can see, he's really connecting his fingertips all the way through his toes and just feeling that, how that whole body can work together through that motion. Just find a rhythm. Right. Um, as you can see, you know, he only took six or eight kicks and he's just not using much energy, just trying to manipulate and move the water with his body. It's very slippery. <laughs> 